I'm going to say reform can happen and does happen and has been happening. Um, but again, personally, I'm not going to make any efforts to reform Islam. I'm going to make efforts to get people out of Islam. That, But that that's me. And uh, I, I think someone in the podcast with Sam, someone made a very good comment that it's like it's like a wafer biscuit and something. Ex-Muslims are eating it from one side. Reformers are eating it from the other side. Mm-hmm. And when they keep eating and they keep chewing it, and then eventually there's going to be no Islam left, or at no, least the the reformers are, are, are not kiss. chewing at anything. They're protecting it. You want? Second of all, I never said reform cannot happen. I said what is is Muslims. Muslims that yeah. are reforming. It's not Islam that is reforming. Right. And Muslims, we all agree on that. And Muslims are reforming because of ex-Muslims and people that shit on Islam, not because of reformers that defend Islam. That's all. Yeah. No, reformist Islams, I mean, they, they do reform for, from whatever outside pressure they get. From outside but they are, pressure? Yeah, yeah, of course. Uh, outside okay, pressure so put always up, bring in the outside pressure. Not the, not, there's no, nothing no, from inside that, saved, that makes Islam better. Um, that's what I'm no, saying. But, but, outside, even the reformist leader... I read this book, right? I read this the book Radical, right? I went through the journey of Majid was and other reformists. It was never in point in time where they were fundamentalists or radical. And they read the Quran one last time and they're like, oh shit, I need to be a reformist Muslim. No, it was always something outside of Islam that convinced them that they should be a reformist Muslim. So if they, if they, become, if they become liberal or moderate or whatever you're calling it now, if they become liberal because of something other than Islam, why, why are they prescribing Islam to other people as a way to reform? Them? Secular Jihadists is an increasingly influential podcast with much of its growing audience in Muslim-majority countries advocating for atheists, secularists, and Enlightenment thinkers. We want to reach out to more people. If we reach 500 patrons, we will be able to translate our shows into Arabic, Urdu, Persian, Bengali, Malay, Turkish, and other languages in these countries. Help us get there at patreon.com slash sjme.